I'm Ben Fisher, I'm Associate Head of Design for Rebellion and I'm working on Atomfall. Atomfall is a survival action game set in 1950s Yorkshire where the player wakes up inside a quarantine zone surrounding the Windscale plant and they have to uncover why they're there and what has caused this quarantine and how to survive the mysteries that they find there. With Atomfall we wanted to try something new and that involved bringing in lots of different reference points. One of the games that has influenced Atomfall is obviously you can see some parts of something like Fallout in there, but also other games in that similar genre like Metro, even a bit of Bioshock. When you start the game, you wake up in a bunker inside this nuclear quarantine zone. You don't know who you are, you don't know how you connect to this larger story. The major motivator for the player through the story is finding out how they relate to this disaster, what this disaster is, how they can escape. We don't tell you what your backstory is, but we plant clues through the game about what it might be. Uh, there are several mysteries that we set up but won't pay off as part of this larger world building. Part of the reason for that is to give you room to express yourself and to make those decisions yourself, but part of that as well is that the history of that kind of British storytelling is to open mysteries and not fully resolve them in a satisfying way. So it fits nicely with the kind of world that we're trying to build. We wanted the combat in this game to feel very kind of brutal, high stakes, kill or be killed survival. So the combat system blends melee combat options with ranged combat. So you can find melee weapons and throw them. You can kick enemies. You can smack them with a heavy strike or jab at them with lighter strikes. And we want you to mix up these options. So you've got to choose every shot carefully. So that kind of high intensity survival is the philosophy we had in mind when building the game. But we want to make sure as many players as possible can enjoy the play experience. So we've approached difficulty in a slightly different way and we approach it instead as different play styles. So the game has a survival element, it has a combat element and it has an investigation element. And we give the player the options at the start of the game to fine tune any of those channels of gameplay to have the play experience that they prefer. Um, we've added lots of accessibility options as well to make sure the game is playable by as many people as possible. Atomfall is coming to PlayStation 4 and 5, Xbox, PC, a day one game pass in 2025.